when you've got your your landing page, the next bit then is to go for your um, sign up or your thank you page. Now, let me clarify what I mean here. They're on a landing page, they fill in a form, and then they should get redirected to one of maybe three things, okay? So the first thing we're going to get redirected to is a one-time offer. So the one-time offer might say something like, hey, thanks for downloading our free guide. Do you want to sign up for a strategy session at £49? Do you want to, do you want to, um, I don't know, do you want 10 free, uh, do you want 10 videos that will cost you £19? A one-time offer. So do you want a copy of my free, not free, do you want a copy of my book, which is 19 I haven't got a book. Uh, but if I had, I would be selling it for 19 99 right? So it's a one-time offer. It's normally 40 quid, but if you buy it right now, it's half price. So stuff like that, we call that a one-time offer. So you're either going to send them to a one-time offer with a potential upsell. You're going to send them to a thank you page, giving them specific instructions on what you want them to do next, which could be to buy something else or go over here and download this or down, you know, get this, um, get this free training course, whatever it happens to be. Or the third one that we like a lot is on the redirect, once they've filled in their details, uh, so let me just go back to that page. Once they've filled in this guy, uh, this form here, it redirects them to a Facebook group. So as soon as they've filled in that form, it redirects them to the Facebook group. And the reason why we want that to happen is, is that we want them to come into our Facebook group so that when they're in our Facebook group, we can continue to market to them through lives such as this or through uh, copy that we write or through videos or through images and so on. So we're constantly looking at what can we do to keep re-engaging with potential clients. And so we always send them over to a Facebook group, uh, which is like a closed session. We have a lot of control over that session. Um, over the content that goes into that group and what it enables us to do is build the klt the no like and trust it gets us, allows us to build the consistency and it allows us to build the credibility as well so that in six months or a year or two when they're actually ready to buy what we sell there's only one person that they're likely to go to and that's us the problem with running facebook ads straight off a page and trying to sell today is that if they're not ready today to buy what you sell you've lost them forever and they'll never come back as we know 90 uh, what is it 70 percent of people never come back to your website and uh, 93 percent leave within the first seven seconds so knowing all of that if we can capture them into a facebook group of some kind uh, then that's going to work really well for us and that will allow us to continually market to the potential clients